30 pages, 30 days. Today's prompt was about sketching on location, really taking in the view and breaking it down, noticing what the people are doing um, and the movement, the flow around you. But being home with a tummy ache today, uh, my flow of action basically was looking at an advertisement that came in the mail from Pier 1 Imports with all fluffy little Easter animals in it, characters. And so I was inspired to draw this little fluffy lamb with a tummy ache in my journal. I started with a pencil sketch and now I'm going over the pencil sketch with my Micron pen. I like this Micron pen because um, you can use watercolor over it and the lines don't run. I'm trying to make the lamb look a little fluffy here with little curly lines. I like the idea of the scarf to give some contrast um, to the white lamb, so I'll make that pretty colorful. I'm making the lamb sit in a bed with a pillow and a blanket underneath, erasing some of the pencil lines, adding a little bit more pen curly for a uh, wool of the lamb. I'm putting some stripes on the arms and legs and making the stripes curve a little bit to give the arms and legs some dimension by putting that little curve in there, kind of a candy cane look to the arms and legs. Coloring them in black stripes, uh, drying. Um, and I use my watercolor paints here. I'm giving them a little bit of green cheeks because he doesn't feel well. When I'm painting the um, while painting the arms and legs, trying to make it a little darker around the edge and lighter in the middle just to give it a little more dimension. A little bit more on the face. A little darker pink in the ears. I'm going to make the scarf uh, light blue and dark blue. Brighten it up. Nice yellow pillow behind the lamb. Choose a bright phthalo green for the sheet or the blanket. Trying to make it a little darker underneath the lamb. A little bit of a shadow. Added a little bit of that color into the pillow on the back. A little more green on the cheeks. Then I decided to take some purple and some gray. Put a little shadow around the body of the lamb. Give the lamb a little more dimension. Making the scarf a little darker by adding some darker blue. Drying it off. And now I'm going to journal. The words are from Alan Karen Dang. Also, jot down your location and the date. Then we live that moment in time when you come back to your journal entry in the future. Those are the words from the prompt today. So I'm going to write down on my journal page that I'm home with a tummy ache today. So when I look back at this page, I can relive the moment.